What's going on guys, it's Omniarch, and today I'm bringing you a brand new video talking about a topic that I realized I really wanted to talk about last night, and I didn't come to this realization until I started watching and catching up on some of the latest YouTube drama and, um, you know, like drama alert and the stuff that was going on between Face Sensor and Sniper Wolf and all the things going on with Jake and Logan Paul, and just all this stuff on YouTube and Twitter and all this other drama and I just I didn't I didn't realize that I felt this particular way until last night and at that point it was too late for me to make a video and I had to wake up for work this morning but anyway let's talk about how I kind of just want YouTube to just fucking explode so what do I mean by this so I feel like we are at a point, and, and like I said, this came to me last night when I was catching up on Drama Alert and uh, Jake Paul and, and that whole scene. Basically, the the whole Jake Paul scene and this huge trend on YouTube where all these people are, that are getting popular are doing it through the most clickbaity, staged, like low entertainment value garbage uh, that we've ever seen on this platform basically um, and it's just really really bad and we've gotten to the point where like and this was the same thing too with like the sniper wolf and uh, face sensor thing where like DMs will go down between creators that are staged in order to be like exposed to fuel even more drama and it gets to the point where all these like creators and I'm not talking about sensor and sniper wolf um, just because censor would never like get involved in shit like that, uh, but you could tell by some of the like messages that Sniper Wolf was sending, it seemed like she was kind of like, you know, provoking him or hoping that he would say something that she could then use as drama. So, basically, what I'm saying is, we've gotten to a point on YouTube where you know, the timeline for YouTube looks like, okay, this the site started back in 2007 or whenever the that was and you have like just random stuff and some things go viral for whatever reason and that's that's that and then there's some people who work you know really hard on YouTube and they start to get even more popular through steady growth rather than just like a trend thing uh, and then some people realize that okay you could do gaming on YouTube and that's kind of cool and like you know some people start doing that all the time and then they make that their job and that's when like you know the C Nanners and Woody's gamer tag and those guys came through uh, and then it it, and then sometime around, I would say, 2011, 2012, uh, drama started to go up because these channels were getting bigger and people started to actually care about what was going on with these people. And so, you know, there'd be like one huge thing that happens in the community and someone covers it like Keemstar and they get millions of views and, and people are like, okay okay that happened and like all these views happen and then it happens again with something else and then you know there's like the i fly and i align i situation if you're familiar with that and it's like you know these things go down and these channels go under and and you know there's some drama going on and then okay now there's drama channels and those are starting slowly slowly uh, and then youtube gets bigger and bigger and bigger and then people are like okay drama is doing really well we can stage drama between people and now it gets to the point where it's like the only thing that's ever gonna get views is stage drama fake prank and fake reaction bullshit clickbait garbage and I'm just at the point where it's like how much longer like what is next what is what could possibly come next like people are gaming the system so hard where you have channels that grow strictly off of clickbait every single video is clickbait every single video is just low quality entertainment like low shitty entertainment garbage basically every fucking video is like that and you know we've built like the, the community has shifted from you know content creators where you could just sit down and make a commentary like this one or even more even better a commentary about something that's on your mind like some some thought that comes to your head or just something you want to teach people like that's what youtube was when i wanted to be a youtuber when i was like shit i wish i had a capture card that was back in the day when we had like wings of redemption making videos you know talking about the different guns in call of duty or talking about random philosophy stuff like just those were the commentaries that i was like this is cool this is cool i get to watch call like really good call of duty gameplay while listening to an entertainment commentary that's like awesome it's the best of both worlds it stimulates me better than television did uh and it was more fun to watch because it was a game that i loved playing and now 
Now YouTube is just fueled to the max. Like we are capped out at the number of channels. We are oversaturated with the number of bullshit, uh, you know, just low entertainment grade videos on this on the site where you now have people like Jake Paul who really uh, are just riding a short-term wave where he, he's not really talented at, at anything. I mean, he's kind of just an asshole, and that's just facts. I mean, you know, that's just how it is. And, you know, his army of Jake Paulers or whatever are between the ages of, I'd say, 8 and 14. So, you know, the people that are supporting him can't even fucking drive a car. So it's not like, you know... Uh, it's not like they have this like solid fan base of people who watched his content and were just like so like they they analyzed it and they were like oh yeah like you know this is why he's funny like this is really good like no it's just it's just like he popped off for some reason and then it's just bandwagon just waves of bandwagoning and like he's the hottest thing so it's like how much longer can we have this platform be fueled on short-term trends like this and like with fidget spinners too like fidget spinners were a great thing they were around for what a month not even maybe three weeks where they were like a big thing i would say a month max you know so it's like how much longer can this website continue to be fueled off of these like 30 second trends that just explode for you know 30 seconds it's like I feel like we're reaching a limit where the site just will not be able to handle it anymore. Like, what, like, what is next? Like, how can we get more clickbaity? How can we get more fake and more staged and more? Like, what could possibly come next? And I feel like we're reaching a point where people aren't gonna trust anything that they see. Where they think every video is gonna be clickbait. That's like what we're going towards. I feel like, like. People just will come to the point where they know that what the title and thumbnail are saying is not what they should expect when they click on it. And at that point, people are going to lose faith in the platform and they're going to go elsewhere. They're going to go watch something on Netflix or whatever it is, HBO, it doesn't matter. They're going to go somewhere else because they know that the only things that do well on YouTube are clickbait garbage. And it's been so long now that everyone knows it's clickbait garbage. And we're going to get to the point where it's just filled to the brim of clickbait garbage and there's nothing else that you're even seeing and everyone's gonna know that it's all fake and no one's gonna keep coming back to the site because they're gonna be like okay none of this is really entertaining none of this is real none of this has actual sustenance that you can really grasp these videos are things that you can watch maybe once a week when it's like oh ha, 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 that's a funny thing and, and you're not gonna come back every day you know back in the day people would upload gameplay but and these are still they're still a thing but they're not as popular as they were before because of all this other clickbait garbage is just showing up in the search results more and more and more and you know now what we have is those other channels where they would upload every day uh, a new entry of a series where they're entertaining you by showing you gameplay and their own spin on things and this you know this whole story and and like you know just thoughtful commentary with actual good entertainment value all of that's being pushed to the side for this new wave of like Jake Paul entertainment that's just vapid empty air it's just like smoke and mirrors that it's there's no there's nothing actually there to keep people coming back you know it's 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 you know it's like it's like building a, fl a fire right with no wood with no kindling it's just fuel and and it can only go for so long uh, before there's no more fuel and then there's nothing left to keep the fire going and then it just burns out It's just after it's done. It's done. There's no saving it. It's over uh, And I feel like that's what's gonna happen to YouTube soon like because we can't like it can't get more There's just no room for more bullshit people aren't gonna start They're gonna start to realize that oh, this is all bullshit. This is all bullshit uh, I don't have time like I'm done with the bullshit. So I want that to happen at this point because I'm sick of this YouTube. I'm sick of the platform that we have today. I'm, I'm not a fan of it. And that's the first time I've said that, I think, ever. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe I've said it before. But this is the first time I really, really feel it. I really feel it. And it shows through my lack of uploads because I don't want to be really a part of this. Like, yeah, sometimes reaction videos are cool. And I like to do reaction videos. But, like, when the only things on the trending pages are, like, this fucking bullshit trends that are only a poppin for 20 minutes like i don't 
that's not the YouTube that I started in. That's not the YouTube that I grew up with. That's not the YouTube that I watched, you know, that or that I aspired to be a part of, like when I was, you know, what, eight years ago or whatever it was when I first started watching YouTube. It's totally different now. It's a totally different website. And I want it to just collapse at this point. I just want it to just crumble. I want them to release an algorithm that is just so good at finding good content not not clickable content not watchable content good actual good entertainment con content i want them to just redo the algorithm with just where it just just does not acknowledge clickbait at all like where the algorithm gets so smart to where when you say omg i got into a car accident in your title and then it, it can tell that there's no car accident in the video it just throws your video to the in the garbage because that's the only way that we're gonna fix the 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 the, the the doom that's coming like and it's probably going to be too late so that like i want it to f all i want it to all crumble i want it to just collapse i want all the jake pauls and the drama i want like i get the drama channels being a little bit entertaining but i just want all the the, the top tier people that have got there from like clickbait low grade shit entertainment i just want it all to collapse dude i just want the the algorithm to change to where it starts to favor honesty in your thumbnails and your titles and your tags and your descriptions and really start to promote that content instead of just what's trending because like i said until that happens it's just way too late for youtube at this point it's just way too late it's just so saturated with shit uh, and it has been for like over a year now and i'm just sick of it so at this point i really just want to see it flop I just really want to see it all crumble. I want to see it just fall to the dust, just get, just explode. And then everyone's like, oh my God, I'm not making any money off my videos anymore. And it's like, because you haven't put any fucking effort into it in three years. Like we're sick of it. We're sick of it. We're sick of it. I don't want to see any more fake pranks. I don't want to see any more of your, your clickbait Star Wars baked goods. I don't care. I don't care. You can make as many Darth Vader cookies as you want. They probably don't taste good. I'm sorry. They're probably fine, but they don't taste. They probably don't taste as good as some of the cookies I've already had. You know. So it's like it's shit like that. You know. I'm just I'm sick of it. I'm sick of the the titles and the, you won't believe what happens when you do this to an iPhone. I don't care. I don't care and I can't wait for everyone else to stop caring too because it's gonna happen and it's gonna happen soon and when that happens YouTube's gonna freak out everyone's gonna lose their shit and I'm just gonna be sitting here like okay can we fucking do it right now can we just do this the right way that would be great thanks let's get back to entertaining and, and like you know having quality good stuff to talk about on here instead of just oh look at my four hundred thousand dollar fidget spinner like kill yourself kill yourself seriously please fucking kill yourself i really want you to i do i'm not kidding really 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 anyway that's all i wanted to talk to you guys about today um if you're still around i just want to ask you guys what call of duty do you want to see me play because infinite warfare i forget that's even a thing anymore i really just don't like I don't know i don't really care for it um and modern warfare remaster is a little bit too slow for me um so maybe black ops 2 but i'm kind of just tired of the game like because we've been playing it for so long now i don't know just let me know what you want to see in the comment section below if you made it this far because maybe you actually want to give me some solid feedback that would help me out a lot and that's about it guys so thank you so much for watching if you're new around here subscribe ding the bell so that way you get the notification when i upload and um like the video if you enjoyed it and uh, that's about it so thank you guys so much for watching this has been omniarch and i'll talk to you guys again soon peace